Uh, oh dear. I'm going to take a look here and see <laughs> who update on the thread. Oh, well, we're being joined. We'll get the interviews underway here. We've been joined by by Iron Iron B Scout for Hello Kitty Ninjas. There's uh, Salentes and Rusty joining as well. I think Natural might be coming from Lego, but hi. Uh, hi. I don't know whether <laughs> I don't know whether to congratulate you guys or commiserate you. I mean, you've been defeated by the Golden Cap point system, but you did win both maps. I'm really salty. <laughs> did you? Uh, whatever you whatever you told Natural to fuck <laughs> off there was that. Was- uh, Genuine just, nah, I don't know. I was uh, annoyed because they lost the point to TC earlier on the season when we beat them 6 0. So it would have been equal, but then they dropped. So, you know. So fuck TC is what you're saying. Yeah, people have yeah, been saying DC. that specifically. Fuck DC. Fuck all all, you know. So I think you can get some uh, support from Flushy there in that oh. campaign too. Who are the people on TC? Like, who was on the team? It was originally uh, Ramagan and Kuna, yeah, then it Ramagan. changed. Yeah, fuck everyone in TC. <laughs> <laughs> Kratos is the biggest faggot on God's green earth at the moment right now. <laughs> Jesus Christ, I can't believe he's done that just so we can't fucking get boxed. Is that why he did it? No, well... Definitely. It looks like it's the only fucking reason right now. It's not our fault, he's shite. <laughs> If he was fucking good, he could actually play Dev 1 and do well. But no, he can't. This is why C-Play drops. Uh, Kratos was supposed to be my co-caster tonight. Luckily, he backed out at the last <laughs> minute. Scared right. to cast he should have backed out. <laughs> uh, oh. So, uh, give us your reactions to the game then, guys. You seem to be struggling. Think back to Viaduct with uh, Ronnie O'Sullivan Helberg sniping there what was going through your minds what was the, the team plan to deal with that because it was sort of you did eventually figure it out but for a while there it looked like Lego were going to take Viaduct uh, we were pretty frustrated at the start and we kept trying to rush things like a lot of us died uh, just trying to focus him down like we wiped loads of times and then uh, I don't know we just started running a sniper of our own and I played scout and things like we we started holding forward so we didn't have the room and that's when we started making all the time back have you worked on that before like you go and skill uh no that was the first time no. <laughs> yeah just making it up on the go you know what was the problem then that you hadn't practiced against a team that played like that or? uh yeah pretty much like every other team would jump two soldiers into us and they they basically didn't <laughs> wasn't really used to it yeah, it was a pretty interesting game from a strategic perspective as well, especially on like, or tactical, like on um, Badlands, like you had good success with your early middles, but then Lego made the adaptation and started sort of sitting back and crushing you on their own train, and I went back and forth like that, but uh, even though you guys lost six middles and won only three on Badlands, you still managed to take it to uh, a 4-4 game, what was the sort of what do you think was the strength of your game there? How was it that you managed to keep coming out on top against this Lego team? Uh, I'll let someone else answer it. Who went huge? Do you know who you're going to sing the praises of? Uh, Aston and 9B always do well, so they can say something, because they're just being quiet. 9B, say something. Aston's not even here. Is he he carries the team, not the me. He said he came. <laughs> you say something. Like that. I don't know. I felt... I was dying a lot, so I didn't really do much. So you're you're saying you didn't carry? You were not man of the match. Confirmed. Yeah, sadly. No, IMB, take some credit. You're good on sniper. IMB, you fucking destroyed Helberg on Viaduct, so take some pre- credit. In, in pre-game. <laughs> and during game. All right, we'll work on uh, Iron B's confidence issues later. We are joined as well <laughs> by Natural, so um, I'd like to hear the Lego perspective. Are you guys satisfied by that result? Obviously, that one point was enough to guarantee you first place, but how did you feel about the Lego performance overall? We feel very, I don't know, satisfied is the word, I suppose, because we've just gone one to one again, again, again with the fucking off-class lineup. You got his fucking demo. stuck by a lot of uh, no mouse pads. <laughs> <laughs> I needed a new mouse pad. 
We had like seven of them. Yeah, we've got some mouse pads by now, but still, I mean, we feel uh, happy to have one once again. Um, and obviously, uh, we mind losing to look at the ninjas. They played well today. And I think we were surprised that they were, were able to beat us on Paradox, which is one of our stronger maps. But then again, yeah, we also we, we, we ran a new strategy with a Sen playing scout. We had two scouts in Sniper, as you've probably spoken about. Yeah, we've seen that a lot. Oh, that the first time you tried it as well yeah, tonight. We, we, well, we, we, we tried it out yesterday, and it worked fairly well. So <laughs> we, we were like, OK, let's go with it. Did I miss anything? Well, yeah, I was away for quite a while. <laughs> I was waiting for you to say something. You make me yeah, feel I, I was on the phone. I'm sorry. Um, what are we talking about? Wait, I have a question for Natural, actually. You know, you, you talked about uh, you guys uh, winning again, sort of with off-class lineup. Obviously, Sunny Black has banned you from Div One, basically, if you win again. So, are you are you plan to keep the same lineup you have now, or are you all going to go back on class for next season? Honestly, I'm not sure what's going to happen because after last season when we also won the one, uh, already back then we were kind of off-lasting. I was playing the demo, um, but but the reason for this entire what shall we say um, change up was yeah 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 switch around was basically some players wanting to play different classes entirely. So we kind of worked around that, and it ended up being this lineup. And to be honest, we didn't <laughs> really expect much going into the, the season. But as you know by now, we ended up uh, winning quite a few games. Who was it, man? Who was the drama queen that said, I don't want to play this class anymore? I won't uh, disclose that, obviously. Zen. F2. Zen. <laughs> but, uh, but either way, I'm not sure what's going to happen next season, because... Uh, I don't think we would feel comfortable playing with this sort of lineup in Prem. Um, so if we are going to play Prem, I think we will switch around again, again, again. You need to recruit more Deans. You should pick up uh, Tutorial. On Spy? Oh. <laughs> sniper, obviously. He's a sniper. Sniper, okay, a sniper. okay. I'm not into the Highlanders. No, but that is, I wouldn't say a problem because I like you know, all the guys to play with them and you have strong team and so on, good understanding. But it is a problem for us that if, you know, someone has to travel or someone has to study or someone has to be away mm -hmm. or wants to play a different class, we have a problem because there aren't like any Danes that can step into the team really and uh, play to the level we are. I see you've got uh, Dr. Leon on your roster. He could at least be a backup. Yeah, well, he was uh, and is um, because he's from Norway, so obviously he sort of understands what's going on in our number. I mean, that's also part of our, our what shall we say, problem in finding backups and so on, that we speak Danish, obviously, which we like. Um, so we can't go international, really. And we won't, I don't think. So what, are you guys going to fold then? Is that the alternative? Speak English mm, no, or fold? No, no, I don't think so. I'm not sure what's going to happen. Maybe you start like a Team Denmark Academy for a load of Danes who want to make it into Lego. Train some backups up. Uh, I won't be doing that. Anyway. Start an academy system? No? Yeah, I, I like the idea, but I personally haven't got the time. And that's also, I think, one of the, one of the bits to notice about our season that we haven't really practiced a lot. We've, like many weeks we've just played the official and that's it, so we haven't practiced maps. The only uh, uh, real map of practice we've had for like, several weeks was yesterday. Because we knew today's game was going to be decisive as to who was going to win the one. And uh, then on the Hello Kitty Ninja side, please change your name. What's going to happen to you guys next season? Have you got any plans to keep it together for season 20? Are you all going to go your separate ways now that you've had the limelight shone on you? We'll wreck everyone. Like, uh, no exceptions. Well, uh, Pablo said he... I, I don't know if he confirmed it or he's just saying he, he, he said he wanted to go and make a Polish team with his Polish friends. Yeah, so, I think that's happening. 
I don't know if it's happening or not. I've heard it. Well, my uh, Polish players are, are leaving to play that. Polish? Are they? Yeah, yeah. Well, fuck Polish players then. Holy shit. <laughs> Just leaving everyone. Cheers, Pablo. Yeah, <laughs> Pablo, you bitch. <laughs> but aren't, aren't you guys going to play like a marbles team in the Prem playoffs? Or I don't know, are we? That, yeah. That's for, that's for Bring you. it on. Bring it on, bitch. I think, I think that's, well, that's the storyline for you right there. Cool Clan versus HKN. No polls allowed. Uh, share to us right now. When do you want to play, guys? Sometime <laughs> next week. I'm available. Holla. I have no clue. Guys, bring it on. I'm B. Rude. <laughs> Fuck you. Heavy fist fight. My best against your best. Winner of the prem. <laughs> wow. So still, aren't you the champion of heavy fist fights? I won. I won a heavy Stop fist fight playing. tournament on the pub server. So I'm pretty good at. We we select Sil as our champion. I've got a question for Natural then. You know, obviously you guys have been through a few different rosters or at least combinations of players and classes. How did you feel about this one compared to the the previous versions? Like was this your best yet as Lego? <laughs> no, I don't think so. But uh I don't really think we like all of us play to our strengths. I mean the the I would say the most positive things the most positive thing about our season was probably Senon uh, target is really good. Um, Four hundred damage. Yeah, but as as for as, as as for myself, I'm 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 a better target than I am a Roma, and I'm probably also a better demo than I am a Roma. And you know, when we go over it, we had like the fill and medic was actually doing pretty well. But then you know, if two and demo, it's it's kind of it's, it's been kind of odd, but still kind of good because you know we know each other, and the calls are the same for the most part. I'm still. That was also like one of the hard bits. I'm still kind of main calling on our team and on the Roma, so I'm <laughs> down a lot. So I think it's a bit weird. As for best place to main call from, you can see everything. Like a coach. Yeah. <laughs> die, <laughs> die first, call the strat. Yeah, yeah, but sometimes it's hard if I'm like on the flank and I'm not sure what's going on. It's hard to call. Hey, go! <laughs> Shout outs! Woo! <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's wrap up the interviews and uh, open it up to the shoutouts. Then please unload your love on the interview or on the internet. Uh, shout out to Kratos and the rest of TC for being absolute gear boys and gobshites. <laughs> Don't go with one again if you can't fucking handle it. Just absolute pack of retards. That's all. Right. The views of Josh, um, the views of Team Fortress TV. Oh, and uh, shout out to Wee Food and TF2 Pickup because he asked me to do it. So that's me done, boys. Ask to your shout outs. Say something. I don't have any. <laughs> I like it. No time for friends. Just time for TF2. No, Anyone else? Shout no. out to Dr. Yeah, Leon fuck DC. for being quite awesome and also uh, murking uh, for one of our opponents and clearly dropping the game. That was nice. <laughs> shout out to he Larval Epsilon Extract, my like <laughs> idol and mentor. Yeah, shout and out Django to Epsilon <laughs> Django and Love. Shout out and... to Ari. Bitch. Yeah, Ari, we love you. He just said me ong to everyone, didn't he? Shout out to Septique as well. <laughs> um, oh yeah, Septique, our favorite Septique. sub. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I'm gonna shout out to the uh, Lego sponsor, Cam, because Nigel forgot to. No, no, he's, I don't think he's actually sponsoring us anymore. Wow, you guys always say shout out to Cam. Yeah, Come on, yeah, man, yeah, give the guy right, a shout actually, out. Actually, I don't think we have a server anymore. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I want to shout out to my boy Commander X, Suyo on the camera as well, Sterling work. Uh, I want to remind everyone that there is a few more Prem games coming up. It's going to be, well, Main Call changed their name twice already. They were Main Call, then Straight Ripping, now they're Uber Sexuals. Don't think Dunk's going to be happy. But uh, they're playing Planet Express on Sunday. <laughs> and uh, then they're going to play Eshock sometime next week, and that will potentially upset the Prem standings if they can take points off Main Call. Sorry, Uber Sexuals, but do you really think that's going to happen? CX. No. No chance. Your Wait, final is that, thoughts? Is that, is that Sunday? Yeah, Sunday. I think I'll be here if you need someone. Final thoughts on tonight? I don't know. HK deserve a win on the night, but I've not seen enough of Div 1 to comment overall. 
Oh, I'll invite everyone as well to head over to etftl.org and get involved in the debate. They're actually genuinely considering changing up the division structure, maybe looking at the Swiss system, something like what ESEA have. So uh, go and get involved in that conversation, whether you're for or against it. And again, look out for these scam links on Steam. <laughs> Plenty of suckers being taken there tonight already. <laughs> but uh, that's it. You just saw the oh, end of Division that. 1. I don't know what happened in the other game, actually. Does anyone know the score of Anime vs. Wookiees? The game didn't matter anyway. Got... <laughs> see it being uploaded. Let me see. Uh, yep. Uh, Wookiees uh, won 3-1 on Viaducts and then 3-2 on Badlands with a golden cap. God, how did we lose to Anime? Holy shit. <laughs> Go Wookiees, and on that thought then, good night and thanks for tuning in guys, shout out to everyone.